the process of burning fossil fuels, coal and oil and natural gas over the last 200 years has released about 500 billion metric tons of CO2 into the atmosphere as carbon. You might think of it this way, we're releasing right now about 70 million uh, tons of CO2 every day into the atmosphere and about a third of that about 20 million tons of CO2 is being absorbed regularly by the oceans. And that ocean uptake then of 20 million tons of CO2 has caused over the last uh, 200 years or so about a 0.1 pH change. pH is a logarithmic scale just like the Richter scale. So a 0.1 pH change represents about a 30% increase in the overall uh, acidity of the oceans. So the oceans has dropped its pH so far from about 8.2 to about 8.1. Using present day scenarios of CO2 emissions, we might expect to see a further pH drop of about 0.3 to 0.4 pH units, which would mean an increase in acidity of another 150 to 200 percent. This is a dramatic change in the acidity of the oceans, and it has a serious impact on our ocean ecosystems. In particular, it has an impact on any species of uh, calcifying organism that produces a calcium carbonate shell. 